Good morning, everybody. Um, it is, of course, New Year's Day, January 1st, 2022. Alexa, cancel. And it's 9 a.m. in time for the Angelus in Psalm 1. And it's a Latin day today. Angelus Domini Nunciavi Maria, et concepti de Spiritus Sancto, Ave Maria, gratia plena Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in ora mortis nostre. Amen. Ecce in cello Domini, fiat mihi secundum verbum tuum. Ave Maria, gratia plena Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in ora mortis nostre. Amen. Et verbum caro factum est, et habitavis in nobis. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tui, Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in ora mortis nostre. Amen. Order pro nobis sancta Dei genitrix, ut dini officiamur permissionibus Christi. Oremus. Grazie tuum quesimus domine, mensibus nostris infunde, ut qui angelo nunciante Christi filii tu incarnationem caniobimus, per passionem eus et crucem, ad resurrectionis gloriam perdutama. Per iundum Christum dominum nostrum. Amen. In nomine Patris et filii et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. And now for Psalm 1. Different version this morning. From the Jerusalem Bible. Happy the man who never follows the advice of the wicked, or loiters on the way that sinners take, or sits about with scoffers, but finds his pleasure in the law of Yahweh, and murmurs his law day and night. He is like a tree that is planted by water streams, yielding its fruit in season, its leaves never fading, success attends all he does. It is nothing like this with the wicked, nothing like this. No, these are like chaff blown away by the wind. The wicked will not stand firm when judgment comes, nor sinners when the virtuous assemble. For Yahweh takes care of the way the virtuous go, but the way of the wicked is doomed. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. And now time for blood pressure medication. A note that today is, uh, in, um, is the holy name of our Lord Jesus Christ. That's what I'm trying to say. Hold on a moment. Let me get in view, grab my water, and we'll take it from there. So yes, in addition to being New Year's Day today, it is the holy name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Um, of course, I hope everybody had a safe and, and um, festive New Year's Eve. Um, 
we had some really nice fireworks out here and I was, uh, it pained me not to, not to have my camera ready. And I knew that by the, by the time I got the camera out and set up, I knew a couple of things. Number one, that it was going to be too late. But I also knew from a practice session a little bit earlier last night that I wasn't going to be able to make the camera do what I wanted it to do in the in the uh, lighting conditions and stuff outside, you know, like with the amount of fog that was there, which wasn't like, I wouldn't call it a foggy night, but for what I was trying to shoot at first, which was constellations, stars and stuff like that, um, it wasn't handling that. And I just knew I wasn't, wasn't going to get that camera you know, properly configured for the shots I wanted to in time. It was just going to be too much of a hassle. So, um, yeah, so I let it go. And when the, the fireworks ended up taking place, I felt really almost nauseous about it. I really did. Um, I guess there's always, you know, the, the, the 4th of July, though, for fireworks. So we'll see. But, okay, so let's do this now. Got our prayer log going there. Cinebril, 20 milligrams. D3, 2000. So, um, what else? Made a guacamole yesterday. Actually got a fair amount of uh, cleaning done that, uh, that isn't a part of the, you know, the normal uh, routine, you know, weekly routine or daily, whatever, you know, like uh, pulling the computer desk out and getting behind there, um, cleaning those baseboards stuff like that there were some pencil marks on the wall um, from around the time I uh, got my chalkboard and um, I finally got those off you know they just kind of stayed there the entire time and when I looked at them I was a little surprised at that you know because I mean it was you know pretty conspicuous at least I don't know if on camera but like, you know, if you're looking at the wall in person, yeah, oh yeah. I was trying to kind of measure things and, and decide how I wanted to orient that wall with things hanging on it and stuff. And um, yeah, so I, you know, drew pencil marks on there to do that, to plan, and I just never took them off there. So that's done. 
Um, I also removed some paint from um, um, uh, light switches and, and the towel rack and stuff in there that I've been wanting to do for a while. There is some paint, chip paint, or not chip paint, excuse me, um, dried paint rather, on a few other things around the house uh, that I want to get to. but. I just kind of do it here and there. I don't want to make it like one big job because there is kind of a lot to get, but it's a lot of little things. And I don't feel like, you know, I'm not going to spend hours at that at one time, you know? All right. That said, um, my plan is to do uh, either morning prayer or post meridian morning prayer for uh, the holy name today. So we'll be back for that. And I was hesitant to mention it because it's late, you know, the past year or past at least six, seven months, whenever I mention something like that, it's like jinxing it. So that's why I kind of hesitated there. Anyway, all right. I love you all. Remember to brush your teeth, floss, especially and say your prayers. And I, whoops, I was not flipping you off, I promise. Um, say your prayers, and I'll see you at the next video. Goodbye. And Happy New Year.